Right. So I think you want to basically make rants about me. Thanks a lot. I honestly accept that. But I think people are kind of confused as in why I want this. It's because, well, to be honest, my channel is just too unbalanced. Let's make it simple as that. I don't like when a channel is always looking good videos. I'm not always having a bad reputation. And since my channel never got that type of reputation of basically hatred, I honestly was like, this is just not balanced enough. We gotta unbalance it. Because it's pretty much unbalanced anyway. And I already heard about the Reagan armor situation. And I honestly have to tell you this plain and straight, she never updated her armor or upgraded it at all. So I decided to upgrade the goddamn armor for her. And also the reason why I basically basically took the armor and upgraded it is not because she wants the not because I want to battle her, it's because obviously to make it easier said done. If I wanted to battle her, I would have destroyed her by turning her entire body into cosmic rust. Yeah, to be honest, my persona's just eat the fucking fat. <laughs> the reason why I say cosmic rust is because this type of rust is different. See what happens when it's like when he touch or basically hit scratch or hit or just toss an object at you or you try to like toss it back as soon as you touch whichever item you touch at he will either make you turn into rust or not and because his ability to do that he calls it cosmic rust since your body will just turn your body will slowly stop moving and then you will start falling apart like a toy that can't be staying together in one piece that's what's so different about Swag Pointy and why his abilities are so fucking broken. Back to the point about the armor. And honestly, the armor didn't get any updates, so I had to update the armor so that way it wasn't going to get broken. Because I didn't want to update the armor and not enchant it with basically with abilities that no armor has. Ability to repair itself. Which is kind of a good ability, since basically if the armor gets broken, she will have to make a new set of armor. And it will get tiring over and over again, and then basically by the time she makes her final armor, she must have realized she's just using a material that can easily get broken over time. That's why I put unbreaking as well, because to make it easier said and done, if we put unbreaking on, it will make it more easy said and done, and not make it break so easy. And because of it, it makes a lot of sense. Now, the Sorrow situation, she didn't tell me to basically not add her into videos, and she didn't tell me to basically not have to use her persona anymore, but she didn't do that. So she only just recently said, don't use my persona anymore, and I was like, I'll just think about it, I'll decide about it. And another problem I think everyone keeps on basically trying to do is basically get power. You may think that's not true, but Queen E... Lazy Weave, or any of them in the group, the only way basically they do things in their rant videos is to get power and basically to control. And honestly, I have to say, you're just stupidly stupid, man. That's not how things work. And honestly, I hope basically the YouTube goddess herself, aka the owner of YouTube, doesn't basically ban their channels for some stupid reason. Yep, I hate the YouTube kind of community. The system of YouTube is broken. ASPD. Now, why I did Reagan and Numi is because obviously I want to make it easy said and done. Reagan, she was confusing as AF. Numi is like looking for two, looking for attention and finding new loved ones, even though for some weird reason, because she keeps on forgetting, it's just gonna repeat ever again. Sara, I have no idea why I did her to videos. The only reason I can only think I can only edit her videos is because of Jesse. And then one just get upset that his girlfriend is no longer in the videos anymore. Also, thanks a lot, jackasses. You made me put them. You made me put them back in the videos. Psych! I got you back. I'm not gonna add them in the videos for a while. So don't even think about it, bitch. <laughs> anyway, back to the point of the video. I was asking myself the question: Why don't anyone want to hear Swag Bunny's actual full name? Since basically, it would be interesting to hear his actual full name. But nobody wants to talk about that, they're telling me to stop, so honestly, I'm like, do you not really want to hear his name before basically, uh, that his actual full name's not actually just swag, it's actually got two S, two 
W's through A's and through G's, making it more like swag that's been duplicated like twice. Also, you may wonder why I want hatred on my channel. It's because obviously to make it easier said and done, my channel was being too innocent, too nice, too it. So that's why I've been having hatred on my channel. It's not because I basically want to be evil. It's because my channel was just too innocent and looking too good. Like any other YouTube channel, and I really didn't like that type of style of YouTube life. And because of that type of style of YouTube life, where basically you have a channel, and because of basically you don't have situations where this and that happens, it makes my channel look like I'm the good guy, and basically everyone else looks like a twat, even though that's not fucking true. That's including Jesse, who's not a twat as well. But I'll bring this up again. The reason why I added Sara, the only reason why I added Sara specifically, is because Jesse was in love with her, and I mean, honest, in some future time they're gonna break up, I'm just guessing. I'm not 100%, it'll be some weird complicated problems again, if something complicated happened, and the relationship didn't work out again. However, at some point of that time as well, they will go back in some point in a few days, if I can think about it. I've always been thinking about situations where basically I always think of Numi because obviously to make it easier said them, the reason why I say that she they're gonna break up again is because Numi broke up so many times. It's conflicting that what if Reagan broke up with her girlfriend and I would be absolutely be pissed off because I'm like if Reagan or Jesse got broke up with their loved one because like obviously that that's the thing conflict thanks a lot Numi. Thanks to Numi giving me the conflict of saying this is just gonna happen over and over again, it kind of made me pissed off my mind. But, let's be honest, this is life, we can't basically break it. So, to be honest, yeah, that kind of situation too. But, Numi's situation, that's like a repeat, so honestly, I can't basically care about it because obviously. She has her own problems and she kind of makes the problems even worse. So I honestly gave her advice. Don't do it too if you don't want to regret it. Reagan, if you're watching this video, just do what I just said to like Numi. Don't do something stupid if you don't want to regret it. And that is basically um don't fall in love with someone else. Specifically, just don't. Because if you do that, you end up wrecking your entire life, causing the whole memories that you love completely turn up down. Same thing to Jesse as well, just don't basically do stu something stupid. If someone just says, that's another thing, just don't fall in love with someone else, that's even if it's a boy or a girl, because honestly, either way, it's going to repeat again, and I don't want you to end up like Numi, having a situation where it keeps on happening ever, again and again. It's like a complete endless maze, like you can't basically find the breaking point unless you do something completely chaotic, but it work, and you get out of the endless maze. Something like that. However, there is one thing I will say to Reagan. If you don't like being called weak, then why do you use the song weak? Like, literally, in every video that I encounter with the intro, well, except for your latest video and your, um, yeah, pretty much your latest video, except for your latest video, it didn't have the intro in, but in your episodes along with the, um, tab. If you say you don't like being called weak, then why do you use the song weak? I mean, seriously, what the hell? Okay, sure, the song is good and all, but if you don't like being called weak, then don't use the song? I'm being honest. I don't know, but I'm being honest. Why do I act like the Smith from The Matrix? I have no fucking idea. <laughs> but the one thing I will say, if you don't like being called weak, use a different goddamn song. Or a, a me song, whatever, just... Don't use the song weak if you don't like being called weak. I honestly have to say that because, like, um, her nightmare, um, her girlfriend's a fango is an absolute bitch, and I honestly have to say, pretty much. But I'm being honest, I'm kind of more likely worth it than her. Let's just say I have a sanity problem, and because of my sanity problem, I am a problem. I end up, um, in my past life, I end up in a fight, and then I end up basically wrecking someone's life. But Queenie, I, 
Okay, I'm gonna have to be honest. This is a question for Queen E. Suspicially Queen E. Here's the thing I don't get about you, Queen E. Okay, you hate the fun in the past, and now you somehow, weirdly, you allowed to be on the fun side. Which I actually don't get. What? In the actual mother of God are you thinking? Okay, I don't know about you, but I feel like that was kind of a stupid move, but I can't basically blame you since you are human. Actually, everyone is human. Besides the point, all I'm trying to say is that basically just don't do something stupid. I mean, honestly, if you do something stupid, you will regret it. Even though you're not going to take my advice straight away, and I know for a fact a lot of people are not going to take my advice straight away. I'm being honest, don't do something completely stupid if you don't want to regret it. Because obviously, to make it easy, then, then I don't want people to end up like Numi, having a loved one, then breaking up with that loved one, finding a new loved one, and then likely to break up that loved one. And then basically the reincarnation of the whole breakup keep on repeating, repeating like a video that's on repeat every time. And because of it, I'm asking myself, I don't know about the loved one because the loved ones, because I don't know if they're good or are they a heat or are they just a bitch or something, I don't know. But I do know for a fact that Scarlet is acting a complete free world. I know basically everyone's going to say that that's not true, you're acting like a free world too, but even I, I know for a fact, I'm not that stupid to just basically just make killing videos like 24-7, like what in the actual, I mean like sure she doesn't make 24-7 like killing videos, like two videos like closing eight areas and all that, but I mean honest, I'm not like her boyfriend who just like, who just basically like makes killing videos like 24-7, like each and every like goddamn day, and like what in the actual flip. Also, I don't know about you, but I don't own the channel Fox the Best Gotcha to you for the reason. Number one, I don't even use the OC for starters. I use like Gotcha Club. I don't even use Gotcha Life anymore for some weird reason, but I don't use it. Number two, I don't use uh, whatever app they use. I'm using Kite Master. And honestly, I just mess with the 60 frame per second system, which I honestly have to say. That kind of works a lot. Yes. But the one thing that I'm always asking myself will there be something to be stupid or everything going to be spared? I just don't know. But the last thing we need is a situation where it's not necessary. But just go out of hand like a zombie apocalypse. And yeah, I'm going to be honest, I'm going to be talking about these um, situations as well, along with asking myself the question, what the fuck is going on with the new, with the YouTube system? Because um, I'm starting to notice there are so much changes to the mobile um, YouTube systems. Like, for starters, um, the comments are those that basically get more than one subscribers. The um the weird thing is that basically um the comment sections are on the top area, not at the bottom as they used to be. And I kinda miss that kind of old system, but I guess that makes a lot of sense. And I can understand that. But but and this is the one section. But um by the way, I'm going to try and see if I can get myself a Masterpiece Transformer, if you don't know what they are. If you don't know what Transformers are, you can go and search it up on YouTube, or go search on them, the internet what they are. But I'm getting a Masterpiece um, G1 Shadow Glass Optimus Prime, since I need to get, get back into fucking stop motion. I mean, seriously, what have I been doing? <laughs> and I really need to basically know how to basically do the transformations for the Masterpiece Transformers that I'm going to get in future videos, along getting a new model kit, but I'm definitely getting a new Transformer after getting a model kit, because I mean to be basically doing something else besides basically getting model kits, because if I basically just get model kits all the time, I'm not basically a good character, I'm more likely just a character that's just randomly buying 
parts and parts over time, and that makes a lot of sense. What I'm trying to say is that I just don't want to basically do that type of sound on this picture to make different one. So this is gonna be my first time experimenting with a masterpiece transformer for the first time in my life. So you might have already checked on the videos, but I mean, like this is gonna be the first time messing with a transformer that's basically a masterpiece. And honestly, I'm not gonna go mess with the um, MP. 33, 43, I don't know what's the name of it, but but that the future model for Optimus Prime, I'm not going to mess with that. I'm just going to go with the um, MP10 model. It's more better. So yeah, I've just been talking about the whole situation, and I'm being honest. Prince Mark is just a twat. Ash, I don't even know what the hell he's up to. Um, Dayton Cox, I don't know what the hell he's up to, but he's a fucking twat. And a freaking pedo as well. I'm being honest, I'm bringing up flipping words that shouldn't basically be brought up. Um, Sierra, I don't know what the fuck is with her. I mean, honestly, why am I saying the what the fuck? I don't know what the hell is with her. She literally just lost her control after basically her boyfriend just left the YouTube system. Ugh, I can't even that happened. And, um, yeah, this is a lot of talk about, and I honestly have to say, my life is kind of in criminal depression. And I have to say, plain and straight, I don't know what to fucking do, but besides talk about it. Yes, I will be talking about future stuff in the future, along with um, this, that, along with how the kind of how the weird copper system works. I will be talking about how that works, but I think everyone knows that, so I don't need to talk about it. But for future YouTubers, I guess I'll basically talk about it. Anyway, I'll see you later. Bye for now. I hope you guys have a good day for those that basically taunt me to death. But psych on you all thinking that I was actually going to add them back. Boy, you fell into my trap card. Anyway, I'll see you later. Bye for now. <laughs>